Good morning, Plumbeer playing World of Tanks, and I'm gonna say it again because it's true. That is how it looks here this morning. We've got blue skies, a few fluffy white clouds. We're just in a spell of high pressure over the United Kingdom at the moment, and uh, it's giving us some really nice, pleasant late summer weather. What can I say? So uh, we're on the serene coast, aptly named. It feels very serene. If it wasn't for all these tanks rumbling around, carving up the countryside, who's gonna? tidy up this mess um, and let's bring up the HUD um, screen passes Tiger 1 I must get a Tiger 1 back in my garage you know saying yesterday that my garage was uh, you know complete and I didn't really chase anything down our sea tank think, yeah, I'd still like to have a game in an M3 Lee <laughs> because just because um, I'm gonna try and support this chaffy fingers crossed Nice little dodge. Didn't want to run into a KV-85 then. Uh, I'm going to go for the extreme angle over here. Is anything going to try and approach the chaffy? We'll try and use this bush as cover. It might shield my uh, gun from its muzzle flash and they won't detect me. Although, if they look across and they see a little bush and they're gonna think, oh, he's probably behind that bush. <laughs> They'll still shoot the bush. Come on, I've got your back. Where are they all? They can't all be over in the uh, west, can they? That'd be so boring. I wanna use my laser scalpel. It's my futuristic tank destroyer, this thing is. It's far too accurate to be uh, World War II era. Yeah, we've got Cromwells and stuff coming down that western flank. I'm thinking Donnie's go back and help out at the base. We've got some TDs over there, we've got three TDs. I'm the only one helping on this side, and now I'm not doing anything on this side because the entire team was pushed up. And I'm no help whatsoever. Right, let's get to this ridge over here and see if we can get shots on that KV-85. Don't drive over that plum. That is certain doom. Come on, gotta aim for his tracks. Aim for those tracks. Is that a building in the way? I think that was a building in the way because it looked like it went true and straight. Only a critical. Ah. Three, two, one. I'm really hoping that went in. Am I in a good spot here? Let's try and get shots on the back of that Black Prince if we can. Oh, I knew that was a little bit low. I could tell my aiming reticule was a little bit low then. That's better. Now he's fully 100% aware of me over here, but can he see me? He's thinking, I'm losing hit points pretty darn quick. What's shooting me? Let's take away his cover. Go for his side of his turret. Come on, laser scalpel. It did hit. That did hit his uh, turret. Come on, he's on 410 left. He's concerned about this. One more. Just one more. That's your mistake there, buddy. <laughs> Should have stayed behind that building. You might have had one more go. Is this guy in render range? He is in render range. Can I see him? I can see him. He's tracked. Hopefully he's used his repair kit already. I know I've been spotted by the T-34. Come on, one more, one more. I can see the T-34 behind the rock. Oh, it's one. What just hit me? KV-85. Nuts. Oh, they're walking through our uh, defences and it's only me left now. I'm going to preload the APCR, see if we can make a last stand of it. This is what you have premium rounds for, people. <laughs> I might have to go with him. 
because my rear is going to get compromised any second. There's nothing worse than a compromised rear. I'm just I'm going to die. I might get two shots into him. I might kill him depending on his hit points. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Now we switched over to APCR. Now the 88, he's never quicker firing gun than me, I think. Yeah, I'm. I don't think I'll have time to get back to the cap. I'm, I'm accepting this as a defeat. Or do I? Is there time to get back to the cap? If there's only one in there, but there isn't only one in there. There's at least. Uh, well, I can't kill him, I don't think. I can maybe kill the 88, because I did some damage to him. So let's get over here and uh, see if we can find him and kill him. Got the right rounds loaded. He's probably still over here. I'm going to be cautious and go around this side. Not sure where the KV-3 is. Hopefully he's pretty slow and he's not going to catch me up. He is hoping. Don't get my tracks, don't get my tracks. Okay. <laughs> Three kills. <laughs> this is a good game of tanks. I'm really happy with this. Come on KV-3, kill me. Kill me! Oh, he's got a repair kit! That wasn't fair. Can I get around him? Use my epic. Ah, uh, didn't have the speed. Go around him, keep him tracked. Bang, bang, bang. They had two artillery though, so it was never going to happen. <laughs> that was a really good game of tanks, really enjoyed that. Love the Nashorn. What's not to like? I came top. I'm not even going to uh, mess about. 560. 1700 damage done, 3 kills, it was an enjoyable match of tanks, lost, but who cares. Even with a regular account we would have made a little bit of a profit, so that's pretty good. Um, I've been showing off my little models lately, and I think I have, you have might have seen it a long time ago, this one. This is my Centurion 7-1, it's not Lego, it's a real, <laughs> it's a real tank. I'm just lifting it up now. No, it's a model tank. Um, and it's a soon Centurion 7 slash 1. And uh, this thing's got a pretty snappy little uh, look about it. It's uh, got quite a nice level of detail on it for what it cost. I think it was about 20 pounds, so maybe like 30 euros or 30 dollars. But it's got really lovely little details on it. Is the barrel straight? Yeah, nearly. <laughs> as good as you want it to be, but it's, um, yeah, it's got some really nice touches on it actually. I've got the box lying around somewhere which tells me exactly which uh, tank platoon it belonged to. It's somewhere in the mess but um, I just thought I'd quickly show that as a little uh, extra at the end of this video. I'm all about the extras. Anyway it's a lovely little machine and it does sit down here in front of my monitor. Ever since I introduced it into the game I kind of fell in love with those 7 slash ones. There is something really yeah Anyway, uh, that's all I've got for today. Nice quick game. I hope you enjoyed that. Nashorn. <laughs> never, ever, ever selling it. Never. I said I'd never sell the Ferdinand. I did, but Nashorn, no. <laughs> Keeping a Nashorn. Might even get a model of it. I don't know. Anyway, um, IS3 replays, please. If you could have a really good game in an IS3, send it in. You stand a really good chance of me using it against uh, Oak's IS3 replay that he'll put up for a head-to-head -head video. Um, so keep your heads down. Drink plenty of water, and I'll play tanks again real soon. Take care. Bye-bye.